kidney stone were crystals that form in the kidneys. It could form because of dehydration, or it could form off when you have too much of the substance that form the crystal in the urinary systems. But once if the stone moves or migra migrations down to the ureter, it could cause severe pain to your flank or your lower abdomen. The pain could be one of the worst pain in your lifetimes and you could have a bleeding in your urines. So these were common presentation of the urinary tract stones. Uh, there were so many ways of doing the diagnostic. There could be x-ray, there could be ultrasound, and now the gold standard is the CT scan. The treatment is depend on the stone size, location, and the stone types. Uh, the treatment option is medications or interventions. In terms of intervention, there are still two or three options. You can do shock wave, you can do endoscopic treatment, or you can do open surgeries. Uh, nowadays, we have the new technologies that we have a flexible scope. Uh, the procedure called RIRS, retrograde intrarenal surgeries. Basically, we're using the small scope, which were flexible. We could put it through the urethra up to the ureter and could go all the way up to the kidneys to remove the stone. The method is we're using laser to break the stone up into a small piece, and then we use the basket to retrieve the stone out. Not many hospitals have the machines in-house. The good news for BNH is we have a full, fa full facilities of the stone. We have all the equipment, we have the flexible urethroscope with laser in the hospital. So the benefit of the patient is they can get, to, get access to the treatment very fast. We can set the endoscopic procedure anytime. So patients who are having pain from the stone in the kidneys, in the ureters that cause a severe pain could have the benefit of removing the stone as soon as we can and they could return to work within one or two days. The best way of preventing kidney stone is to drink more water, hydrate yourself and if you have any signs of flank pain or lower abdominal pain in one side with the bleeding in the urines, you should seek medical attention. When I had uh, my kidney stone problem, it started in the night and I having already a big pain in the whole night and I decided to, to go to the uh, nearest hospital visits for us, the BNH hospital, uh, to see what I can do and, and the emergency team took very well care of me they made all the necessary checks and uh, when, I, uh, when I finished, they identified that there is a stone. The reason of my pain was a stone in the kidney. And when I had uh, the final um, talk with a, with a doctor, which was very professional to me, and he described me different options to have. My problem was that I, I wanted to go on vacation the following week. And it was a vacation which was planned already for a long time and it was more than three weeks. And he said, um, usually they're doing treatments over a longer period of time to try that first. Um, there were other options as well available. And the last option was um, that you do um, an operation to take the kidney stone out. And uh, he advised me to do that uh, because of my travel next week to a foreign country. And he said, this will get you painless. The stone would be out and we are supporting your, your internal organs with a uh, rubber band, with a tube, uh, which helps me uh, in my day-to-day -day business and everything. And it, it really worked out for me. So uh, over this period, uh, it, was, it was lovely and I didn't have any pain during the vacation. The good thing was, and I was very impressed with the reaction of the doctors when he said, Maybe can we do the operation then? And uh, he finally, uh, he said, we can do that maybe even tomorrow. And, and uh, I was looking into my schedule and this and that. And I even suggested if we can do that the same day. And, and, and he looked and he checked and he was willing to do that same day. And this was very impressive for me. 
So I decided for doing it same day to get everything done. So when I woke up uh, already in that in that uh, special uh, rooms which you have prepared for this, um, the doctor came back and looked after me. Everything seemed to be fine. We, I was then checked in into that room on the upper floor where I was luck, looked after very well. Uh, I have to say I was very impressed with the service you're providing there because on, on, a, on a regular basis somebody came and looked after me and checked me, checked blood pressure and, and I was on, on certain instruments and, and everything was smooth. They, they asked me for, for my uh, meal options and, and I didn't know what to say and what to order but they have showed me as well a, a kind of menu like you find in a hotel restaurant, in a normal restaurant uh, where you can choose from and, and you, can, uh, you can do your ordering for uh, the dinner, I had as well the ordering in a similar way for the breakfast. Um, I then had during the night time a flawless experience that somebody came and, and made sure everything is smooth. And in the morning the doctor in the early stages he came and, and he checked everything with me. And I was very impressed with the whole, uh, with the whole process, um, I have to say. And, and after my vacation when I came back and checked back with the doctor, we removed the stands. Uh, on an appointment, um, these rubber band, which was as well very smooth. So all in all, uh, I have to say the um, the services provided was was very professional, and very good. Another good thing I want to mention is that the doctor prepared me for what's coming. He said, "You will do. You will feel like this after one day. You will feel like that after the second day." So all these things helped me in understanding whatever I had. I said, I know because the doctor told me already. So the information flow was, was, was great, was good, and that helped me as well to feel, uh, to feel at ease. I, I think the entire team, I think uh, it is not like, like in a hotel, in, in my hotel here, it is not one single person. I think it's a team of, of people who are, who are delivering as well as the experience. And, and uh, definitely you need a good doctor, which you had, and, and I felt comfortable in his hands, but he needs as well uh, helping hands around him, uh, whether it is in, in the overnight experience or during the process, and, and everybody was helpful, everybody was, was eager to, to uh, make sure that you are at ease and everything is fine with you. To be honest, I am I'm a, a big big fan uh, of, of B&H, and, and I'm coming uh, for everything I have and I'm recommending you to my hotel guests and I'm recommending as well to my friends and I'm sharing with them the experience uh, what you have here in Thailand and um, uh, I was traveling around the world in, in my career with Miss Hotels uh, working in different hotels and, and I had as well the need for different doctors during my, my life and I have to say that uh, here in Thailand I, I'm more than pleased with the services you're providing here.